What is that? Oh, wow, look, that eagle's chasing the crippled. Good morning, everybody. We got some more cold weather here in Virginia. Got lows in the 20s again last night. So this morning, we're gonna be out on a little creek doing some jump shooting. I've never floated this creek before, but there's a lot of swamps around it. And we were riding around this morning, kind of just scouting, and pretty much all of the swamps were locked up. So I'm thinking the birds should be on the creek. Uh, just came down from the launch, actually just jumped two wood ducks as we were launching. So good sign already. It's just Drew and I and uh, pretty skinny water. So hopefully we get some close flushing action and uh, keep it safe out here on the moving water. So we're going to get to uh, going downstream and hopefully we get on them. Oh, wow. Lots of geese moving right now. Unfortunately, goose season is closed in this part of the state at the moment. So I'm sure we're gonna see a ton of geese today, but we can't even shoot one. Gosh, look, they keep coming. Like 50 wood ducks. Oh my gosh. Look at all the wood ducks. Coming back over. Ooh, Drew, Drew, Drew. On your left. Holy smokes. Never seen wood ducks like that. Hopefully they go back down the creek. Looks like it's been brushed this season. They just keep coming from the left. Yeah, we got ducks up ahead here. We'll try and hug the right side and get up on them. It's just going slow. Yeah, real slow. Still. 
right in front, Drew, right in front. You get one behind? Oh, Drew, they were three yards in front of us. Nope, I don't think so. I think the one I shot it got away. Dang it, some poor shooting today. Picking up empties, but no birds. Not how you want to start a morning. They were right in there. I couldn't see how many there were. We knew there were some ducks below the geese, but I wasted my shots on some bad opportunities. Damn, they got the setup here. Fishing rod holder. They leave us any shells? What is that, a snow goose? Someone's farm duck. What is that, someone's Aflac duck? Yeah. What is, what is going on here? A farm duck and a Canada goose that won't fly? Come here, I want to talk to you about your car's extended warranty. Come on, guys. What are you doing, Aflac duck? And I guess crippled goose? Yeah, I guess that goose is crippled. I don't know what there's an Aflac duck is doing in the swamp, but I'm not particularly interested in shooting one. just a little too quick for us today that's why it's hard to jump shoot out of a kayak it's hard to get that paddle down and the gun up there might be some ducks mixed in Bang, 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 bang. Where are the bands? And there's another cripple. Oh wow, look, his leg's real messed up. He can fly, but. What is that? Oh wow, look, that eagle's chasing the crippled. Holy smokes. Look at him, this eagle's gonna kill the cripple. Yeah, look at that cripple, he's got his head down. Wow, watch this. He's gonna dive on him, isn't he? Eagle's gonna watch his meal. <laughs> I love the AP Goose Zone.
Get your gun. Why didn't you shoot those? That was like 35 yards for you. That was not too far. You could have killed one of those mallards. Yep, nice. Finally on the board. Oh yeah. Full plume January January wood duck. Doesn't get much prettier than that there. Whew. Finally got a decent opportunity and made the most of it. Got a pair. Nice old pair of wood ducks. <laughs> two more. I think we got two hens. I don't know. <laughs> I don't care. No, I'm glad we got. Yep, get ready. These ones might come back around. I knew there was going to be some right there. I was just about to whistle to you. I know. I had a big one too. Get ready. They're coming back over. And we each got one again. So, finally making the most of our opportunities here at the end of the float we're just about to our takeout now though so i think those are probably going to be the last shots we get How did I not kill any? Well, I hope you enjoyed that hunt. This was definitely the most interesting float that I've ever been on. I've actually never seen an eagle actively hunting waterfowl before, so seeing it chase that goose was absolutely wild. I'm not sure actually whether or not it ended up catching the goose. It made a, another pass over the goose while it was on the water and then landed back up in the tree, and at that point we decided to keep on heading down the creek. So I would guess that it probably did end up catching the goose because the goose's leg was pretty messed up. It couldn't take off the water very well, but I can't say for sure. And I think if we were to try this float again, I would like to try it in a canoe. I've actually never jump shot out of a canoe before, but this creek had a lot of long straight stretches that the birds would hang out at the end of because I think they had the best visibility down there. And because it had so much, the creek had so much current as well, we had to keep on paddling the kayaks at pretty much all times to keep them from drifting one way or the other. So I think if we had been in a canoe with one person at the back steering and one person at the front shooting, we would have been able to make a lot less motion and hopefully get up on some birds a little bit closer. But um, this wasn't a barrel burner. Drew and I had no complaints about that though. We ended the morning with four wood ducks and these were fat January wood ducks so just about the best table fare you can find in my opinion hope you enjoyed the video if you did I'd really appreciate if you click the click the subscribe button because I'm gonna have a bunch more videos coming out this month and hopefully some new hunting videos coming out here in a couple weeks and if you had any questions about the hunt leave it in the comment section down below and I'll be sure to get back to you hope everybody out there is staying safe god bless and thanks for watching uh -huh.